right, George. Yes. Uh, you've told me a lot of great stuff here in the last 20 minutes. But uh, tell me about the uh, two-in-one header that the, that the, uh, that the Vance and Hind Harleys are running. I think that the way the V-Twins are built designed with the 420 degree and then the 300 degree intervals on the post time, that it's really hard to make a two-in-one uh, successful. So if you want to slow down uh, uh, two-in-one, uh, excuse me, a V-Twin motorcycle, I think you put a two-in-one header on it. And it pretty much slows the bike down. So whenever you see Eddie and Andrew go really, really fast with a two-in-one header, it's just my opinion that they have a, an exhaust pipe in the truck or at home that would go a lot faster, which would be two straight pipes or two individual pipes. And um, so since they won 10 races in a row with their two-in-ones on the Harley bikes, they've made all the Buell guys build nice two-in-ones because it's got to be faster. Um, it doesn't matter how many headers you got, how many pipes you got, it's how many cams you got, how many valves you got. Double overhead cams, four valves per cylinder, make way more horsepower than how many exhaust pipes you have. So I'm thinking that if we had a, um, it, it put most of the Buell guys to sleep for a little while trying their two-in-ones. We missed out on a couple races because we ran a two-in-one. But when everybody went back to the uh, two individual pipes, we all went faster. So I think there's a power left in the bank there. And that uh, when 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 a Buell gets very close to, uh, oh yeah, I believe we're gonna we're gonna see the straight pipes. Yeah, get the when two somebody straight catches pipes up with the Harleys, I think they'll take their two and ones off and go back to straight pipes. I think. All right, just an opinion. Anything else? M I M H O.